Well, this is an oddity that I've uh, long wondered about. Uh, using a pressure washer to hydroform steel or stainless steel. And I'd never done it. I'd seen it done freeform a couple times. I know that they use big machines and lots of pressure to do it to form complex shapes. I welded these together and I turned down this little steel fitting on the lathe. It basically is a, a copy of uh, the actual pressure nozzle outlet. I just took the dimensions and made a steel one that I could weld into this piece of plate. So you can make up an infinite number of those without pipe fittings. Or I suppose you could always you know, buy one with, with a threaded end on it and thread it into a pipe fitting and, and weld the pipe fitting into your work. And then this is a folded over piece of sheet metal. So I'm going to put water pressure in there. I'm going to probably surround this with some sort of safety blanket so if it does burst I don't get uh, any shrapnel effects. But let me hook it up to the pressure washer. By the way, this, this plugs in here, the end of the handle to the pressure washer where it would normally put the spray nozzle. So I'll plug that in there, start the pressure washer, and put a little pressure on it, see if I can expand this piece of metal and see what happens. Well, that's pretty cool. In a pinch, you could make up a fuel tank. You saw I had a few pinholes where the water was squirting out under pressure. So quite cool. Now, I could go back and weld up those spots that were spraying, where my uh, welds weren't tight enough to hold the pressure, and probably get this to fill up more. But you get the point. I mean, at this point, it's created about a one quart steel capacity. You could weld this up, get it airtight, and use it for an oil tank or a fuel tank or any number of things. Artwork. Very interesting stuff. I'll tell you another application this could be used for is pulling dents or uh, particularly with motorcycles and uh, vehicles that have aesthetic expanded tanks. You could uh, reshape and reform those tanks fairly easily without Without damage or rupturing it, just throttle the, uh, the water pressure slowly and get all kinds of results.